So how do you turn off permissions to download apps on the iPad? Let's get started. And if you are new on the Fox Tech channel, most definitely subscribe so you do not miss tutorials and videos like this one. Well, all of the things which you need to find can be located in the settings app of your iPad and the restrictions or permissions, right, can be found in the screen time section. So in there, we have the content and privacy restrictions and you can tap on app installations and purchases. In there, you can see we have the ability to allow or not allow App Store or installing apps in the first place or even have like the app marketplaces that can be allowed or not. So you can see if you have that like not allowed, make sure you switch it to make sure it works. Or you also have the ability to turn off the restrictions altogether with a click of a button like that. Just disable the toggle and all of the restrictions will be gone. Right, so that's kind of how it works. Another thing which I want you to take a look at is within the Face ID and Passcode section of your iPad. And there I would encourage you to have the iTunes and App Store turned on for Face ID scanning, right? So in that case, you will skip the verification with the whole Apple ID password. And instead you will be able to just scan your face and get your apps, right? So these are the things which you might have in mind. You know, these are the restrictions which might be in place. And the very last thing which might be going on is a profile, right? So when you check out the general section of your iPad settings, you can go to the VPN and the device management. And in here you, you can see that it is possible to sign into work account or school account. And you know, if the admin or whatever, whoever set up that account on the iPad doesn't allow downloading apps, well, in that case, you will have to at first go through this, just, you know, enable it within the school account or remove the account to make sure that the iPad works as usual. So let me know if you managed to make it work. Thanks a lot for watching and stick until the end. Most definitely subscribe so you don't miss tutorials and videos like this one. And I'll talk to you later.